Hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough 7-4 The Trio returns Guess who's returning? Come on, take a guess. T take a guess. <gasps> the shard! Yes! Wow, this is it! The last shard! We did it! We really did it! How about them pearls? Yeah! Uh, Starf, what's that? Uh, behind you, look out! Oh, I should have known it wouldn't be this easy. Everybody, run! Or swim! Or something, just go! So here comes the snarkle! No! Uh oh. I think it ate the shard. Oh no, Mega Snark swallowed the shard! I can't believe this! We have to get that shard back later. Uh, right now, what's important is saving our shells. Swim for it! But quietly and gently. See that? See, Moe's got the sniffer going on here. So you actually want to make it to the end of the room before going inside the snark this time. Okay? Okay. 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 Anyway. <laughs> I just love that. It just, it just stops. You know, it just surprises you by jumping up on the screen. And <laughs> it's sort of like those chomps. In uh, Yoshi's Island, that that chomp you, and then once you reach the edge, they bite into like some brick or concrete or something like that, and they break their teeth, they cry, they fall off. Yeah, it's it's that sort of humor. <laughs> Try and aim for the openings uh, of the currents. Oh shoot! Oh shoot! Oh shoot! Oh shoot! Okay, like. Uh, Rather than going through the current the whole way, just go for the holes to try and avoid uh, being stalled more than you have to be. Hey, look who it is! Alright, we've got to figure out a way to get that char back. I think I've got an idea. If we could somehow get inside Mega Snark, uh, what up, wait, uh, I'm gonna, um, I don't know. I'll play Loot Shuffle here with Fork. He can give us some info that'll help us. What do you say, Star? Time is short. Which one? Uh, I'll, I'll do it later because time is short. Alright, I'll. I got a feeling that the big shark is on his way. Well, maybe we should actually do so. I mean, I, I think we have enough time. So, yeah, let, let's... Uh, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, yeah, yeah, I know about that. I already kind of explained that. Okay, find fork three times in a row. Use your star spin. Alright. Watch the treasure chests. Watch them carefully. This is actually really easy. <laughs> Look how slow they're going. E. And he looks so disappointed, like, oh, I didn't think he was going to find me. <laughs> They're going slightly faster. Oh, boy, we'll never be able to keep track of it this time. One more. For the win. Here we go. Loot shuffle. I was, gonna wa I was wondering if that middle one was going to move. And, well, they only shift four times each round. Nobody's ever found me three times. What? No one? I can't... I can't believe that no one found you three times. Like, even by luck. Like, even if they somehow couldn't keep track of the chest, chances are they would eventually, if they kept trying, found you three times. Eh? You want to know how to capture Mega Snark? <laughs> I don't know how to break this to you, but no one can catch Mega Snark. Secret 3 has been added to the map! One dot. <laughs> And there we go. Alright, through the door. And now let's get eaten. Come on, come on. Through there. I'm moving, you can see me. Yes, eat me. Tasty. Even though you swallow me whole and you don't really even taste me. Alright, so there's a treasure chest in here. Gotta find that. Just trying to go slow to look around there. Um, Wait a second, hold on. If I go up here, it's the way out, right? Right, 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 yeah. It's gonna poop me back out at the beginning of, yeah, the beginning of the level. Okay. To get back in there. Come on. Come on, you can do it. Come on, eat me, eat me, yes. Also eat the rope too, that would be good floss. <laughs> All right, oh, Globerto. Five darn fellow again, huh? Huh? <laughs> okay, I'm calm again. 
Anyway, uh, I didn't press the Y button early enough. Okay, so there's a shard. You see it up there? It's up there. I don't know how it got there, but it's up there. We gotta find the door to said shard. Where is the door to said shard? I don't know, but I want to find the door to said treasure chest. <laughs> Definitely the treasure chest before the shard. Um, this, you're gonna come across another one of those multi-path things. Yeah, one of these. Uh, so let's start at the end, I guess. And this time you can't go back once you hit the water, because once you... Oh, it's not, it's not the path. Because once you hit the water, um, yeah, you end up past this current, you can't go back up the current. Um, no. Oh, um, uh oh. Um. Um, can I? Well, I have to play this level twice. Because <laughs> I think the treasure just is in another path. Yes, you found it, Starfy, and the shard is still in one piece. Looks like even the terrible stomach of the Mega Star couldn't digest the shard. The question is, how do we get out of here fast? I don't get the feeling that anyway else going to be something gross. Probably because you're right. <laughs> oh, and out the poop shoot. Jeez, she wants to give a mega shark a stomach ache. Let's get out of here before it gets back. Let's find a safe spot where you can put all these shards together. All the pieces of my ship. I can finally go home. Back to my people. Yay, Starfy! Thank you so much. Let's hurry up and put it together. Go, 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 go. Grab the trust. Oh. Why would you leave that behind? You know I'm trying to 100% this game. And, you know, with most Sniffer, I, I would think that he's gotten, a, you know, treasure appeals to him. So I thought thought he would grab it, but I'll oh, forget it. Snips his diary. Let's read it. I like the way things are going. The big boss is completely wrong. Up to now, I wasn't sure. But this is awful. Uh, what are we going to do? I wish we could just use the forbidden technique to get Bunsen and go home. Forbidden technique? What? They have something... They have something that we don't know about yet. <gasps> Sharp! Like old cheese! Snips! Heavy! Like Mama's meatloaf! It's like the Team Rocket motto all over. Like, you know like, how they repeat themselves? I mean, they do the motto every time they appear all together. <laughs> Wrapped like an angry present. Papes! Together we are the Terrible Trio! I mean, Terrible Team Trio of... Snips! Wrong! Papes! So bad! <laughs> so silly. <laughs> <laughs> Great idea, guys! Oh, that smell! Oh, no. Not the stink bombs again. Oh, come on! Haven't you learned from last time? <sighs> Actually, I think they just repeated this cutscene. <laughs> God, you guys again. Your timing is consistent, at least. Um, yeah, we... Come on there, tough guy. What do you want to say? Finish that sentence. I dare ya. Why can't you leave us alone? I'm trying to get home. I thought you said you had a change of heart. You come with us and, uh, and then we'll leave your friends. Um, maybe we should just, uh, change of heart. See, Bunston, basically means don't have, even have hearts. Hey, that's not fair. Uh, nah, look, we're sorry for uh, the trouble. Um, keep the shark, because, uh, what's with you long cats? Suddenly you're not such big talkers. Oh, forget it. Apologizing isn't working. We're the bad guys. We're taking Bunston right now. Oh, just go ahead and make a move. We've been training a lot, and we're ready for you. I say it's time we take care of you goons once and for all. Wait, no, let her talk. Gah, I'm done listening to these no good chumps. Let's take them down. Then we can hurry and fix up your spaceships and so you can get home. <sighs> Alright, let's do it. And they ran. What do you think, Starfy? They seem sorry, sure, but actions speak louder than words, right? Enough chattering about those buffoons. Let's mount up and get our shells in motion. <laughs> oh, nothing different? Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Go, 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 go! Boss door! You're gonna tell me to get Starly, aren't you? Aren't you? Aren't you? Those three still haven't learned their lesson, Starfy. Want any help with this one? Wanna call on Starly? No! 
No! Haven't you listened? <sighs> Save. <laughs> Alright, let's go in and battle all three of them at once. This boss is known as the Terrible Trio. I recommend that you divide and conquer by taking care of one... Oh, poopers. <laughs> Stop that. This, that's why you want to take care of them one at a time rather than all at once. Yeah, you gotta hit papes behind him. Oh yeah, he can't be inside the shield, otherwise he's protected apparently. I forgot about that. Alright, I'm gonna leave um, Snips up there because Ronk right down here. He takes up a lot of the screen. <laughs> Let's just be honest here. He's a pretty big guy. And he's also pretty slow underwater, so... Pretty easy to hit. He's like easy mode underwater. Alright, and you just hit yourself. I didn't even do anything. <laughs> and whoops. Ah, Xbox D-pad of Hades. <laughs> Alright, one more hit. Mm. And there we go. <laughs> you didn't even put a much of a fight. I think Snips is actually harder alone than she is with the group. Alright, so they're down. You can't talk to them. Let's move on. Okay, now let's put all the shards together. Eh, what's wrong? I think Bunsen was onto something? Well, maybe so. I guess Pape, Snips, and Ronk have actually helped us a little bit. It seemed pretty sorry uh, this last time around. Ah, I hate being wrong. Oh, swallow your pride, Mo. Well, it's certainly not going to win any spaceship beauty pageants, but at least it should work. Now that this is set, what's our next move? So it's already back together? When did you put it together? I don't know. Hmm. Five armed fellow, of course. Of course, you would call me that again because you don't have any other dialogue. <laughs> Ooh, I'm a spooky ghost. Ooh. No, I'm not spooky. I'm so friendly looking, I'm like Casper. <laughs> yeah, I could just go like through enemies like this, but I was trying to make a combo of sorts, I guess. Um, eh. Why didn't I hit the A button? I don't know. <laughs> I mean, why didn't I hit the B button? Excuse me. Um, well, that was a b pretty boring corridor. <laughs> Save! And... go. Okay, right here is good. Plenty of room. Looks safe. Okay, so you didn't put it back together. Oh, forget it. Soon I'll be able to help my people. I'm a little nervous to get back to them, but I'll worry about that later. Let's put these shards together and see what happens. All right. Woo! That was pretty easy. Just kind of magnetized them themselves together. And whoa, what's going on? Oh. Hey, uh, sorry guys. If we go back without Bunston, he'll mashimize us. So what if we're on crutches? We can still beat you. Bring it on! What? What? All right, fellas, let's do it. Our super secret special move. Dun dun dun! The paper cut crusher. Don't don't just stand there. Get out of the way. Oh, pain! So much pain! It's rock, paper, scissors time! <laughs> no, literally, rock, paper, scissors time. Yo, oh, oh, dizzy. Oh, slow down of emulator. <laughs> oh, alright. Arena time! Get your styluses out! <laughs> In this case, it's a mouse. Alright, watch the terrible trio on the top screen there. And watch for any signals of a hint that they are going to hint at them doing something. Like their move, I should say. Time to face off against wrong peeps and snips. Tap an action on the touch screen to play rock, paper, scissors. Alright, so. Let's watch them. See if they do anything. Okay, see there's one that was a little bit late there. So that was wrong, so choose paper! Yeah! Yeah, they always sort of hint at what they're going to do next. So yeah, just pay attention. Yeah! 
So in other words, it's not a luck-based uh, rock, paper, scissors game. It's a pay attention rock, paper, scissors game. And rock again, really? <laughs> and it even says rock on screen, and yeah. <laughs> it's definitely, definitely not... Um, definitely, definitely not luck-based. Lock, lock wait, it said rock, scissors... Well, maybe it doesn't tell you with the text on the screen for... I don't know. But they definitely tell up here by... Uh, by their movements. Anyway, rock beat scissors. Yeah! Take that! Two bosses! One level! <laughs> now I'm gonna get rid of this pointer. <laughs> Why do I feel some sort of respect for these guys? They're pretty good fighters. What? They, they kind of failed to, uh, because they gave away what they were going to choose and... Oh, forget it. Are they, are they okay? Yeah, they'll probably have to eat some Eat a big shame sandwich. A shame sandwich? What's that? Oh, come on, Bunston. It's something bad guys have to eat when they feel bad about what they've done. Maybe we'll let them have a little ketchup and a side of Justice Fries. Hey, hey, no? Not funny? Well, I tried. You get the point. Gah! Uh, uh, wait, what? Gah, Bunston. Is this thing on? Those audio guys said they'd fix this thing. Gah, where'd that horrible voice come from? Not from rocks, papes, or snips. <laughs> In fact, let me deal with them first. That voice! Oh boy! Oh! Bunston! Bunston! Speak to me! Who are you? How do I know? That's it! It's the voice of the space pirate, Mashtooth! Mashtooth? <laughs> nice memory you have, my long-eared little prince. I bet you never forget anything. Well, actually, well, forget it. I'm the most powerful space pirate in the galaxy. Mash truth! Wait, did I already say that? <laughs> Whatever. Prince Bunston, I demand that you come to me now! I shall destroy your sweet home planet of Venera and everything that you love along with it. <laughs> In a distant corner of, the, of space, far from the cl cloudy lands of Puff Top. Planet Banira. The people of this planet, the Banirians, had a mysterious ability that could shapeshift. They used this power all the time. It was just a part of their daily lives. Like all Banirians, Prince Bunston was born on this planet. Long ago, Bunston's father, the king, had a vision of the future. When, with, when, ah, when his son Bunston was born with a powerful gift, the king foresaw a day when his son would use his power to protect the people of Banera. Many years passed until one day, the dreaded space pirate Mashtooth heard word of the Banerians' amazing power. Oh boy! Oh boy! He came to steal it for himself. Sound the alarm! Intruders! We're under attack! Your Highness, run! Prince Bunston! Hurry! Get to safety! No, I'm no coward! I can't just run and hide! I said move it! <laughs> I knew it! These Bonarians, they're stuffed with it. Delicious power. But to dominate the galaxy and become the strongest, I need more. You. <laughs> See these flop-eared squeezy toys? Which one has the most power? Uh, Lord Mashtooster, um, uh, maybe they're Prince, sir? Prince Bunston? Excellent. <laughs> Find him. Bring him to me. Soon, I will be the strongest force the galaxy has ever seen. <laughs> hey, Prince Bunny, quit hiding. Get Bunston. Where is he? Find him. Mm -hmm. These snack-sized Bonarians, 
They've given me a lot of power, but I want more to be the strongest. I need to inhale the power of their pathetic leader, Prince Bunston. What's taking so long? Where's Bunston? <laughs> Over there. I see his ears. Oh boy. Hiya! Oh! Pain! Oh! And now you know the full story of what happened on planet Banera. Get him, you fools! Bring Bunston to me! There's the kid. Got him in my sights. Ready? Aim! Alert, alert, alert! Warning, warning, warning! Warning, warning, warning! Alert, alert, alert! Fire! I like how they put together all the cutscenes we've seen so far in a way that's, you know, understandable. Because before you had to put everything together, um, yourself. But now that they put them all, all together after uh, seven four here, then it makes a whole lot more sense. Well, unless you somehow figured it out before now. Oh, ouch! Mm -hmm. Who, who are you? I'm a blurry starfish. Now I'm clear. Where, where am I? Oh, soccer ball? A window? What happened? Star bed sheets? Um, you really like stars, don't you? Oh, my head! Everything's turning white. Where did I come from? <laughs> who, who am I? I, I don't know. I can't remember. What should I do? And now the present time. Ah, oh, yes, it's coming back. What? What mashed you said? I remember it all. I'm from a faraway planet. Planet Banera. I am Prince Bunsen of Banera. On my planet, everyone is born with the power to transform, and Mashuth wants to steal those powers. That's why he attacked us. <laughs> Very good, Prince. Would you like a carrot? I've already absorbed the power from the other puny Banerans. However, there is one Baneran plus power that I still crave. Yours! <laughs> Lord Mashtooth. Hey, uh, Snips, can you hear me okay? We wanted to tell you that we, um... We found some sort of Baneran energy um, under this rock here, and this energy is saying that we shouldn't use our powers to hurt people and take their things. <laughs> Instead, we should use our strength to help people who cannot help themselves. That kind of spirit, the spirit of generosity, that's the true power. Yep, that's what it says. Really? Oh no. Well then, I guess I should just abandon my plan and take over the galaxy, huh? Wait, no! You can't trick Mash you that easily! Wrong! Papes, snips, meet your doom! No! Stop! No! 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 So I guess that's what happens if you go against Mash Tooth. Oh! They're taking the hits for them! Oh no! Oh! No, Bunston, I'll be waiting for you on Banera. Oh! That was terrible. I've seen a lot of bad guys up till now. But this guy takes the evil cake. I don't. I don't know if we can beat him. He seems to be very powerful. Did you see that? Wait, what am I saying? This is not the time to get scared. This is the time to not get scared. I've got to get the Banera. Ash Tooth, I'll stop you. You're going down. Clench fist. Thank you for everything, Starfy. Mo, I wish there was a way to thank you, but I have to go now. My people, I have to hurry. Wait, kid. We're pals. You can't ditch us. You can't take on Mashtooth solo. We're coming too. But I could never ask that of you and Starfy. It's just too dangerous. <laughs> Fourth wall breaking. Can you believe this kid, Starfy? 
We've been in nothing but danger since we met. Plus, me and Starfy here have been clobbering knuckleheads for a long time. Oh, if only people knew how many other Starfy games there were. Well, they probably already do, because I already explained the origins of the Starfy game series. But still, I want them released! I want to play them! Anyway, if we just left our pal to fight the big baddie on his own now, what kind of chumps would we be? Pals? You really think of me as your friend? Whoa. Starfy, well, thank you. There's no time to waste. I'm coming to help Banera. I'm being in line a legendary heavy hitting hero. Starfy! Just hang on. I'm on my way. I'll be there soon. Finally, all the shards have been found, and Bunston should have felt relieved. But his planet was in grave danger. Starfy and friends blasted off to defeat the muscle-headed space pirate Mashtooth. Their destination? Bunera. We can't go there yet! We can't go there yet! In fact, we can't even end off this part yet. Because we gotta go back to stage 7 and get that other treasure chest that I missed because I took the wrong path in the guessing game. And oh shoot! <laughs> Didn't mean to do that. Well. Preview of Planet Banera. Okay, we're going back. <laughs> and there we go. Now we're at 7 4. Uh, if I go uh, hit the mini game door, it won't really matter because, it, yeah, the mini game door is at the end of this room and all I have to do is get eaten by the snark. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, we're back in. We are golden. We are good. Let's rush through this remaining level. Well, not the remaining level, we've already been through the whole level. What I mean is the remaining parts of the level that uh, we have yet to see. Uh, where are those stars, those um, those star blocks when I, that I seen when I came down here? Where are those? What, what leads to those? Like, anyway, I'm going to start from the left side and go down now, since I started from the right side and it failed me. Okay, this this goes... Oh, this is this is a return trip. Oh, wait, maybe it's not a return trip. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Ah, oh, this is where the star blocks lead. Whoops. Press the walk button. A little bit too early there. And that's okay. Got the treasure chest! Alright. Spacesuit. Sweet. Just a, just a couple more rooms to go here. Oh, it boots me back out up here instead of rather than down here. That makes sense, because, you know, gotta, um, gotta find your way. Oh, that's another dead-end room, and oh, I guess there's only four paths here. I thought there was more. Anyway, back to the map. Oh, oh wait, 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 wrong button. <laughs> oh, and now it's clear. And with that, I'm gonna end off the part here. Hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next part.